show my Adam. I'm starting all the way back here so that you can see the new short they got me for Christmas. Yay, Peter John. Anyway, come in, come in, come in. So I don't know what the uh, audio quality on this video is going to be like because my last video was scrapped because I used the new microphone that I got for Christmas and the hum on it was so bad I had to scrap the video because I couldn't fix it. It was it was awful. I've pl however I've played with the settings and somehow magically just by setting it off auto and putting it onto a set number uh, it is magically not humming. Now you may think but I can hear a hum and that is actually because this microphone is quite powerful. It seems to be picking up everything even the background noise in the room and that little radiator is on because it's cold out and in and it hums so the hum you can hear isn't the hum of the microphone it is literally humming that is in the room anyway today's video I couldn't decide what to talk about but then with my job I was called up to do two days of letter delivery for the council which I had to walk around two of the local villages which added up to about a half marathon in distance over the morning and a, d a full day that I was doing it. Now I not only have a respect for Postman that I didn't have before, I have a deep-seated hate for letterboxes that aren't user-friendly. I mean, we need letterboxes and we use them every day. Why aren't they user-friendly? Like, granted, you need draft excluders, but I don't know what the little bit of skin above your fingernails is called, but they've been scratched to hell and back from posting these letters through doors. And like, because of the, the bristles in the draft excluders, you can't just push the letter through because it'll get crumpled on your side of the door. So I had to feed my hand through people's letter boxes to feed the letter through. And then so you're, so you're scraping your hand all the way in and you're scraping the hand all the way out. And then you're moving on to the next hundred houses that you have to do. Walking around in the rain and the cold and the sleet and the ice. It was a very unpleasant two days for me, I have to say. So I decided to have a rant about how much I hate letterboxes. And I thought it would amuse you because it's such a random thing to have a dislike for. But I really do feel for postmen, like they have to do this every day. And there's a lot of houses around you that have old rusty gates. And some of them, the latch goes up, some of them the latch goes down, some of them you have to um, pull a latch in before it can open. Some of them are just so old that I was trying to figure out how to use the latch, thinking I have to figure out a puzzle before I get an entry to this house. But actually, you just need a bit of elbow grease and you need to give it a good elbow and push your way in. And then there's the houses with the perilous stairs. So not only are you walking up and down stairs all day, you're walking up and down hills because we live in the valleys. Uh, but anyway, what else do I hate? Yes, old doors with vertical letterboxes. They are a pain because you have to like stick your thing up the top. You have to push the flap all the way in and they still not enough room for you to get the letter in. It's very irritating. But my fingers were cold. People were getting damp letters because everything was just getting ringed on. There was nothing I could do about it. And the worst ones of all, the worst ones of all, are the houses with the horrible gates down a flight of perilous stairs. They had letter boxes that were four inches off the floor, like right at the bottom of the door. They had thick bristles and as you pushed her in, a dog tries to bite the end of your fingers off. I had countless close calls with dogs trying to bite her as I was feeding it through the letterbox. And then all of a sudden, like it would be ripped out of my hands and then I would do barking and be like, oh. But like those people are not gonna be able to read that letter. That dog has destroyed it, for sure. Definitely destroyed it. I think that's my rant over. I don't think I have anything else to complain about other than how much my legs ache. Bye bye. Kill the, kill the, kill the, kill the, kill the. Beep.